Hey everybody, we're going to be looking at Space Designer right now. One aspect of this today, and that is synthesizing your impulse responses in Space Designer self. If you know much about impulse response type convolution reverbs, then you'll have a good appreciation for what this does. But for those of you who don't know, you can measure spaces using an impulse or a sine sweep. You play that out in the space, you record it, you can use this deconvolving process, ends up with this little impulse. And that is like a fingerprint for an acoustic space that we can then apply to our sound. The original. And this is a bathroom, by the way. And it sounds like a bathroom. But without getting too much under the hood, I just want to describe this one process where we get to come through and change some of the settings. And by doing so, we actually can synthesize an impulse response. Every time I click this, it synthesizes the new one based on our settings here. So I change some settings, synthesize it, And so you can see how all of these are playing together to create a new impulse response, which we're synthesizing as we do things with each of these parameters. So awesome. Something that's really useful when getting just the right sound that you want. And at some point we need to look at actually importing impulse responses because I have a ton of them that are pretty awesome. And we'll look at those at different time. Okay. Hope you enjoyed this. See you tomorrow.